that forest has fallen. I was wondering which stance Jared was going to fight in. Oh, there it is. And I say there it is is because the habit that I've seen with Jared oh. is he leans back. There's a right hand that comes in from Jared Anderson, and now he jumps on Forrest. Ooh. Forrest punches between punches with a left hand that scores. But Jared Anderson right back on it, battering him in that neutral corner. Forrest covering up. Anderson letting those hands go. Ooh. Right hand comes in. Another big right hand. Jared Anderson scoring well against Forrest here in a very active heavyweight first round. Forrest covering up. Eats a left hook. Anderson digging in. Uppercut. Body shots. Forrest trying to fight his way out of this situation. And Anderson so active. That youthful energy. Punch after punch. Lands a punch on him. He gets upset, he gets angry, he gets mad. And he takes all of his anger that's built up his... Look at the ropes is holding him up right that's now. That's right. He's trying to use the ropes. He's trying to use the corner. Digs in. Good double up with the left oh hand. Oh, my goodness. Body shot comes in from big baby Here Jared Anderson. The pace that Anderson... No, he can box, but look at the pace that he's fighting at. Oh, my shot comes in. This fight is over. Jared Anderson stomping his way to victory. Chopped down the forest. Jerry Forrest done in two. Think about this guy. Here he is. He just needed to get Forrest in the right shot. That's the right hand right there. Stood him up. Another shot on the top of the head. That pretty much had Forrest out on his feet. And it's the right stoppage at the right time. He switched up his game. He threw a lot more punches in that first round. He didn't need to do that this time around. He let the punishment soak in. And now just the right shot will get us to go home. And he came out in the first round in the southpaw stance. Then he switched orthodox. That shows you how versatile he is. He's versatile. And the amount of punches that he threw. And the punching powers you got to deal with. The reflexes. And just that toughness right there. That's the difference. That's what I'm looking for in a heavyweight. There is wow buzz here at Madison Square Garden because Jared Anderson, the next great heavyweight from Toledo, Ohio, living in Houston, did it again. He's 13 for 13. He dismissed the veteran Jerry Forrest, who hadn't been TKO'd in over nine years, and he did it with output that was sensational power. 39 power punches landed in round one. That's the most by any heavyweight in 2022. Your corner told us before the fight, it doesn't start till he gets hit. You got hit early, and then you came back with 114 shots in that first round. Walk me through that barrage of punches in that first round. Well, first I want to give a happy belated birthday to uh, Bob, man. Shout out to Bob. Man, he got so much love and so much support for me, man. I love it, man. Thank you so much. Um, but like my corner said, you know, once I get hit, it's a whole different ball game. You know, I switch up everything, really, my mindset, how I fight everything. I tried to come in cool, calm. Uh, I see everybody kind of was expecting him to go out early. I didn't want that. I did want to uh, get all the way warmed up. But once he did hit me, as y'all see, some flipped, and it's just all I saw was red. So the 114 punches came, and, you know, we picked it up. The Grinch showed up immediately after you got punched. Fifth consecutive second round knockout, and... 13th consecutive knockout victory. What would you say you take away from tonight's performance? Um, you know, to keep my composure even earlier on, you know, I, it shouldn't have to take me to get hit for me to be able to do that, you know. Uh, but everything was kind of, you know, all right. Once I started to, you know, adjust myself and get my feet up under me, you know, um, I have been kind of off for a little second, but I definitely think I, I, I came back and made it better. Jerry Forrest had five losses on his career. He only been stopped one time, but it didn't happen like this. You have a very clear list of guys you want, and tonight was about proving where you are. Who are those guys? Uh, you know, all the big names, all those people who are ranked, anybody in the top 15 or any, um, you know, uh, WBC, WBO, WBA, anybody up there, you know, uh, Philip Hergovich, you know, um, Frank Sanchez, all those big names, Dylan White, Daniel Dubois, the whole list, man, the list goes on. 
um, everybody, you know, I, 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 it's a business, you know what I'm saying? And we got to make those fights, man. These people want to see these fights. Michael Hunter, everybody who, who got a uh, O, it got to go, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it. Let's get it indeed. All right, Joe, an impressive performance from the real big baby, Jared Anderson. And nice to see it in the heavyweight division.